That should be a fun one. Let's go. That is actually a pretty scary pitcher they've got there, but oh, whether yeah, he can uh, actually live up to those stats is another question. Redliners have amazing pitches. Ugh. But, uh, this is all in on pitching this season. Yep. Yeah, it was after form we said that they went all in on batting instead last season. They had fuck all pitches. I'm just oh. like, hmm, yeah, going all in on batting didn't work for us. Uh, let's swap over to pitching and see how it goes. Oh, Maybe wait. next season they'll find a 50-50 between the two. Yeah. I just realized I can do the timestamps so much easier if I just time it correctly. Anyways, whatever. Um, <laughs> uh, this is going to be a game. Yeah. All right, Kemp, come on. Don't screw me over for a third game in a row. As she reluctantly hits the home run. He <sighs> <laughs> just oh one hell of a job. That was so close. Hey, it bounced off the wall. The that is the definition of malicious compliance right there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If that had been any other field, I don't think that was making it out. No. Yeah. It's like, I will hit it exactly hard enough. You want me to try? I will try the exact minimum <laughs> as I... Jack, this oh, thing. Taking the sky fracture <laughs> approach, I see. Yeah. How about the first baseman, number 24, Julius Lee? Also, the other funny thing, too, is if Gamble and lose, then all four um, Queensland teams are two and two. <laughs> and we'd all be tied standings wise. And I would find that funny. Now back to the second baseman, number 50, Trey O'Donnell. I love that baseball logo. The more I look at it, the more I appreciate it. Good. I'm glad we went to the work of getting it just right. Yeah. I also love the, also, the Red Lighters logo too, though. I think something that I love about the baseball logo is just on that top section up there, where it gets cut off is ex exactly the right height. Yep. <laughs> I like both these teams. I mean, again, I also really like how the Red Liners, strange as it is, the font fits the stadium that we're playing in. It's kind of that Southern style. Why do you keep setting Le uh, Lagrangian? He hasn't done a single thing. Oh, Even last season. <laughs> yeah, because who else do you have? There you go, see? I think that's the best hit he... Oh, that's one of the best hits he's ever had. Greco the Gecko Rotten. Come on, Greco. Oh. Oh, cheeky. Oh, see. Oh my god. 
Oh, oh my god. <laughs> sure. Thought that was okay move. then. That pinpoint oh. accuracy from Rentworthy Bo Boyle. That's twice now seems to be like a big bad minimum. Jimmy, come join us in the two and two club. I mean, at the moment, it looks like it very well might. It's very, you feel very distinct and average. <laughs> I do that on a daily basis. So then you should be right at home. Yep. Good on you, Bun Chrome. We have, we have home brand Ritz crackers. Oh, my plan's gonna walk you up having zero average. <laughs> like, what is the most average, like, food thing to say that we have? Yeah, we have stale home brand crackers and um, tasty cheese slices. I don't know why the uh, went I feel to like that's sites. you know on the lower end of things. It's not quite average enough. No, we we've got we've got Wonder White bread and butter. Ooh. <laughs> Wonder White bread butter. And, no, no, we have Wonder White bread fairy bread. <laughs> we sparkled it up uh, a little bit. Okay. We treat ourselves. We treat ourselves. <laughs> oh. Oh wow. That was a ding. Okay. This is a match. <laughs> I guess someone's too good for our Wonder White bread. <laughs> Might have to rescind your invitation to the average house. Come on, Benitez has been better than this, man. Yeah. There you go. How about my field number five? Brett Glover. Brett Glover is the George Williams that I want on my team. No, it's not. This is right. <laughs> Oh, no, never mind. Now back the third base, number seven. On the map, he looks so much faster. Hope it's owner, it's just not showing up. If you see the team mascot around, why is Logan Reliable suddenly really good? He, he has like no power too. Of course he's even going anywhere. Who is this? Not a clue. For someone named Emerson Shavewell, they have not shaved very well on their profile picture. <laughs> He's a retired barber. <laughs> Good one, I guess. Ooh, the count. The count is in. There's a motherfucking vampire. What are you talking about? He hides his undead eyes behind the sunglasses. <laughs> Can't do nothing to hide those sunken cheeks, though. Mm. No. I'm disappointed that they didn't go for a double play there. Uh, they couldn't. 
Like, the, the guy was clearly back at second. Yeah. That's not a force out, so they would have to, like, the second baseman would have to catch the ball, reach down, make the tag, then turn their entire body around and throw it to first. Fair enough. Oh. Rosa? Should have gone for the double play there. I agree with you, Jimmy. <laughs> mm. Greco looks like a creature. He is a Man, creature. Redline is better. Is it just on point today? Yeah. I mean, they were due for one yeah. The ones that are usually real bad have actually been the ones doing decent. Something about division rival, like division games, man. Division games. Oh, Greco. <laughs> Greco Rotten is actually like legit. Legit yeah. now. This is getting kind of crazy. He's trying to beat the uh, thing you've done allegations. Yeah. Now pitching a collier. Strike. Normally Count Lushley does a lot better than that. That was a uh, yeah. yikes. He's out for the count. I can um. lay down for sleep. <laughs> oh, come on, Jimmy. I had to. <laughs> oh! Look, I understand you had to, but... <laughs> that doesn't make it any better. It's funny, because you can use that both ways. He's, he's either taking them out for the count, or he himself is out for the count. <laughs> need him to stop being out for blood. Okay, you know what? I'm going to straight up say it. Even though the, the, the Redliners are the team that is the absolute toughest team still for the second season in a row for me to predict. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Because You're a very strange team. Hold on. You had them near the middle somewhere again. Yeah, I had them near the middle. That's fine. But, like, their style of yeah. play... Um, yeah. I'm going to say it right now. I think with that last run that was scored. Yeah, you currently lead the league in points scored. <laughs> I, Zero to three in leading. In points scored. You, yeah. like, but that's what I mean. Like, I thought your team was going to be a batting nightmare, great pitching. I think you've given up the most points and have scored the most points. So, like, the exact <laughs> opposite of what I thought. I'm getting sick of your shit, Redliners. Why can't you be normal? Why can't you? I mean, it just makes that entertaining. Mm. You are the only team to not be involved in a shutout game. <laughs> oh. Uh huh. Like either. You know, being shut out or getting a shutout. You're the, there's yeah. been no zeros in any Redliners game so far. Uh, people getting the money's worth. Mm. <laughs> How about the first base number 24, Julius Lee? whole central division I've never been able to predict. Ooh, good dive. Oh, he hurt himself. That's all. Oh. Malachi had tended to like, like, one player that I remember the name of, but never remember if they're actually good or not. He was distinctly average. <laughs> oh, okay, that's probably why. You yourself at the end of the game. Hmm? What was that, Possum? Meditate you yourself the at game. the end of the game. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, one day to nap. Da, 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 da. All right. 
And with that win, every team has won at least one game. Ooh. And Jimmy joins the 2-2 two two club alongside Night Fury, Gargler's, and Mandalore and Ocean Song. And gets to have that uh, one the bread with butter and the uh, yeah. Honestly, can't even be mad. Fairy bread's great. Red Webby Boyo MVP. Yeah, I think that's the first time that has ever happened. Him being anywhere up there.